getting sick of Andy being on the TV. Shouldn't he be here? Well, I mean, that's why, I think, I mean, that's why I'm hoping this television thing works, because then, you know, once they can figure out how to get the the ions and the, the particles, and then you can, right, like in Star Trek, is that what you're talking about? No, he's just on the TV on a camera. He's not actually here. Right, but he's, it's part of the tele, he's trying to, what they're trying to do is zap him. That's it. Hello, I'm Cookie Masterson, and I found this kazoo in the trash. <laughs> Nameless? So sad. I'll help. If you do well, I'll upgrade you to Will the Beast. Then that'll be your new, non-new name. And our wrong answer of the game is sponsored by... Peeping Todd's Pervert Supplies. Get out of the bushes and into our store. Become a member today and we'll whack off an additional 10%. Sniff out our sponsor's wrong answer of the game and you'll end up with a great prize and serious cash. Okay, let's hit it. Get ready, time for question. One. Right off the top. Birds of a feather do hip-hop dancing together. Which contestant would you not see on the talent show America's Got Talons? A singing condor, a dancing owl, a juggling falcon, or a whistling crane? Watch your time! Sorry, no take backs. Here's what a right answer looks like. Condors, owls, and falcons are all birds of prey and have talons, but a crane does not. Why do I have a feeling that Howard Stern's opinion on this show would always be supported by Robbins? And now, I was lost, but now I'm drunk, and it's time to pour a dis or dat. I'm gonna read off seven things, and for each one, you tell me if it's a book by evangelist Billy Graham or a Guinness advertising slogan. If it's Billy Graham, press the square button. If it's Guinness, press the circle button. Cool, let's do it. Out of the darkness comes light. Hope for each day. The secret of happiness. Answers to life's problems. The most natural thing in the world. Believe. How to be born again. You did not choose the path to righteousness. I had a religious experience after drinking some Guinness. Although once you've drunkenly interrupted a baptism, there aren't many churches that'll let you in after that. Dance with me, Disco 3! Coming up next, every quest you take. What do the police and Frodo Baggins have in common? Both fought over a ring, both have a sting, both have a love interest named Roxanne, or both are from Middle Earth. Time's running out! Sting is the lead singer of the police, and also the name of the sword Frodo carries with him. Both can also really shred a mandolin. This one's known as... Do you smell what I smell? Okay, so... Oh, sorry. We've, we've got all this garbage in here, and the smell almost made me puke on my microphone. Looking through your trash bag What's it say about you? Okay, what do we have here? There's a lot of soft felt, and there's a Pizel, a Biz Cochito, and a Florentine. Whose trash is this? Kermit the Frogs, Big Birds, Cookie Monsters, or Elmo's? Oh, honestly. Hmm. 
these are these are all types of cookies from around the world. So yeah, this is uh this is Cookie Monsters trash. Throw in some used candles and a Nicholas Sparks book ruined by tears, and this isn't much different than my trash. Next up, you're not the cake boss of me. If the cake boss were commissioned to bake the cake that Alice ate in Alice in Wonderland, what instructions would he have? It needs to make her bigger. It needs to shrink her. It needs to let her see in color. Or it needs to give her seizures. <laughs> Time's almost up! No, but speaking of shrinking... <coughs> allow me. After Alice drinks the potion that makes her tiny, she eats the cake that makes her become huge. Can you imagine getting huge from eating cake? That Lewis Carroll had one wild imagination. <coughs> round one is complete, and you haven't even broken a sweat. Keep in mind, all the prizes are doubled in round two. And don't forget, our wrong answer of the game is still out there waiting to be picked. Let's move on, shall we? Here's one I like to call, Air She Blows. There's so many sub shops now. Subway, Quiznos, Jimmy John's, that nice restaurant inside Target. But my personal favorite is Blimpy, because it's just fun to say. Blimpy! Blimpy! <laughs> anyway, Blimpy. If eating a Blimpy sub gave you the same kind of gas that is used to fill a modern-day blimp, what would you have? A hydrogen? A nitrogen? An argon? Or a helium? Yep, these days, blimps like the Goodyear blimp are just filled with helium like regular balloons. Now, imagine eating a Subway sub gave you the same kind of gas you usually smell when you're on a Subway. Question 7! It's time for... Wild Times in My Mouth. Which of these is not a candy bear, a gummy grizzly, a red licorice red panda, a sour patch sun bear, or a peeps polar bear? I so wanted you to pick this one. The red panda is not a bear. It's actually closer to a raccoon. Great! So I've been taking sexy photos on raccoon skin rugs? Yeah, no, I'm afraid you're in peep trouble. Which is why you're lucky to have won this giant shrub costume with built-in binoculars from Peeping Todd's Pervert Supplies. Keep your hands where no one can see them. This wrong answer of the game comes with a bundle of cash worth $8,000. Congratulations. This one's called, You're Wearing the Hell Out of That Harpsichord. I know you can't see me right now, but I just want you to know that I'm wearing my piano key necktie today, and I have to say, I'm looking pretty damn sharp. But tell me this, if it worked like a real piano, what sharp key on my sharp-looking piano key necktie is basically the same key as a B-flat? A-sharp, B-sharp, C-sharp, or G-sharp? <laughs> Sweet dreams. Here's where the money is. To play an A sharp, you hit the same key as when you play a B flat. It's the black key between an A and a B. But I'd rather just play some bluegrass on my banjo underpants. Oh god, oh god, that was a terrible idea. <laughs> Here we have, she said what? You know how people like to say that's what she said? Well, which of these is actually what a she said? Parting is such sweet sorrow, to be or not to be, my kingdom for a horse, or what light through yonder window breaks? <laughs> the 
This line is delivered by Juliet in Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet. The rest are all said by dudes. Wow, Shakespeare quotes. That was a hard one. That's what she said. Get back to work! Next, the heavy metal music of old. Suppose you're at a geological timeline music festival, which sounds amazing. What band should immediately follow the queens of the Stone Age, the princes of the Bronze Age, the kings of the Fire Age, the princesses of the Iron Age, or the dukes of the Quartz Age? <laughs> The Stone Age was followed by the Bronze Age. The Princess of the Bronze Age isn't a very good live band. They make too many eras. Brace yourself for the attack. When you see two clues that match, press the X button. 2,000 bucks if you're right. But if you're wrong, you lose 2,000. And don't forget... Remember the clue! It's gotta be a match that fits this clue. No thanks for the memories. Who's having some memory problems? Good luck! Just some fucking baby carrots, bro. Whoa! But they look like big carrots, only way fucking smaller. That's just fucking it. I don't have time to fucking eat an adult fucking carrot, but with baby carrots, I can pop one in and be on my way. No fucking way. Baby carrots. They're so fucking tiny. Do you owe the IRS money and back taxes? 10000 20000 100000 We can help. The law offices of Wilson, Hanson, Young & Associates can help you get out from under tax debt by faking your own death. It's true. For just a small fee, our lawyers will help you fake your death, easing your tax burden. Exploding motorcycle, alligator attack, saving the world from an asteroid. We promise your fake death will not only be convincing, it will be cool. No lame, no lame deaths, deaths guaranteed. guaranteed. As an added bonus, we also provide a DVD of your funeral. See who comes, see who cries, see who suspects. 
And if anyone suspects, we'll, we'll take, take care, care of them. them. Call the law offices of Wilson, Hanson, Young & Associates to help you fake your death. And remember, we don't get paid until people are fully convinced you're dead. We also specialize in DUIs and wrongful paternity suits. Introducing your face's new best friend. Say goodbye to dry skin and wrinkles. Bye. Goodbye. See ya. Say hello to healthy, radiant, beautiful skin. Well, hello there. Oh, hey. Hi. Because you're never too old to look 10 years younger. Yes, please. Yes, please. All new Virgin Blood Face Mask. I can feel it working already. No harsh chemicals, just 100% all natural blood from a dying virgin. And a pinch of black magic. Shh, don't tell anyone. What price will you pay for youthful skin? Anything! 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 Kill her! Virgin Blood Face Masks, only $10.99 a bottle. That's actually really reasonable.